What's up guys, Nepenthes here, and welcome back to another episode of Fatal. If you guys don't know what Fatal is and you've missed it for the last about a year and a half, two years, then where have you been? Of course, if you don't know what it is, um, go watch episode one, Rules Are Explained. There's a lot of YouTubers involved in it. Links to those bad boys are in the description below, along with the links to uh, my clothing. Not this clothing, this is obviously Sidemen clothing, but if you want anything from Nepo Designs, check it out. Link is in the description below and use Nepo and check out. I haven't said that in so long. Hello? I would love an ice cream. Let me tell you a little story before we get into today's video. I know this makes no sense and means nothing to the to the actual video, but you can hear that ice cream van outside really loud because it's like right outside. Like I have a window there, and it's basically like right outside that window. However, my front door is the other side of the house and out the street, and I can't get there in time to actually get an ice cream. So, um... No ice creams for me, uh, which is sad. You don't care about that story, but there it was anyway. Anyway, guys, in the last episode, a, a narrow victory for Choice 2, which was Lehman and Matuidi over Seaman and Lacazette. Um, 15,000 votes to about 11,000 votes, which was insane. But I said something in episode 1, that in, it, like sorry, in episode 2, that encouraged a whole bunch of likes. You guys smashed over 21,000 likes on the video. If we can get anywhere close to that again, I will be absolutely amazed. I can't thank you guys enough for the unbelievable support you have given on this series on my channel. Uh, it's just absolutely amazing. So we do have another legend in the team. We now have three Arsenal legends, uh, ex-Arsenal players, Vieira, Campbell and Lehman. We've also got Matthew Eady and um, <sighs> Frank Ribéry in the team as well. And uh, I do just need to change uh, Vieira back up to a striker because I was using him in my um, in my main team back as a midfielder uh, for a few games. And uh, we're going to go ahead and get him back into that striker position. We can use him as a centre forward. It's all the same. And uh, this is a team so far. So we'll be looking to probably improve a fullback position and a, a midfield position here today. And then we'll fill in the last midfield position or the striker probably last in episode five um, so that Vieira can try and get as many goals as possible. However, my midfield seems to be stupidly good at getting goals. So I am tempted to maybe do a fullback and a striker today. Uh, hopefully we can afford a fullback. Um, with that being said, guys, this is the team we're using in the next couple of games. Let's go. Okay, guys, into game number one we go. He's, of course, has got 100 chem, full silver, La Liga team. Uh, a few of these players I used myself, like Halilovic and um, Meduyanin in the last version of Fatal. And um, they're good players. I think I actually still have that centre-back in the team as well. I'm not quite sure. But, yeah, it's a good team. But we have got legends. I actually changed formation as well. Um, just before I came into this game, I went from the 4-3-2-1 to the 4-3-1-2. I put Vieira at Cam and uh, Frank Ribery and the other silver guy up a striker. Uh, I'm, I'm looking for a change in formation, I think. So it might not be good for Vieira for this um, this episode until I can uh, put him as a striker and change the, the whole team, perhaps. But we're going to try our best. And if he does do well as a cam, we might well leave him there. But anyway, things have started off. Vieira's picked up the loose ball. He's got Frank Ribery in. Ribery stopped his run. It's gone to Ravit. Ravit, surely Ravit. Oh, he's put it over the bar. Zogbia's broken in. He's got Patrick. Can Captain Fantastic do it? He can't on Zogbia. He can't either. My God, even when I can shoot, I still can't shoot. Go and tuck it inside. Yeah, you know you wanted to do that. Oh, that's lovely. Surely, Ravit. That is a beautiful goal. Lovely run inside. Through ball comes in. I have a feeling... This is going to be a rage quit arena because it's nil nil and he's already sliding around like his life depended on it. So one nil, Rabbit scores, and we get 20k in the bag. Oh look at that! We've got space down the left hand side. It's Frank Ribery. He's got Vieira far post. Can he find him? It goes all the way through. Vieira's going to pick it up. I don't know whether he's going to be able to score from here or not, but uh, we'll give it our best shot. A few running in, and it's going to be a corner. And I think Vieira is still taking my corners. He is. We're going to whip it in with him. This will be the last one he takes. Maybe not if we get ahead on it. Oh, it's 2-0. Maybe not if we get ahead on it. I think that's Blaise Matuidi there with his debut goal. Patrick Vieira whips in the corner. Fantastic set piece. And boom, there's the header to make it 2-0. And it was indeed Matuidi. 2-0, 40k in the bag. Really? 
This also isn't what I'm liking to see. I don't like to see that at all. He's bought an Aguero. He's put it in the back of the net. Three minutes in. All because Patrick Vieira can't win a header up the other end of the field. It's crazy. Tried to get in there with Campbell. Wasn't happening. And uh, we're, at, we're now down to 20k as the, uh, the increase. But uh, we've got a bit of... Go on, Frank. Go on, Frank. Oh, that's a banging goal. I could have laid it into Vieira, but I wanted the coins. And more importantly, the winning uh, scoreline back in the bag. We go 3-1 up. Frank Ribery from kickoff. Dances around a few defenders. Scoop turns past the last man and shoots to the top bins. And that is 3-1. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. See, now this, this is where we're at. This is where we're at with Vieira, trying to feed him goals. Trying to feed him goals. Just feeding the goals. Feed the captain. He will score the goals. 30 extra thousand coins in the bag. That puts us, what, 30, 50, 70 thousand coins now for this game so far. Lovely work there. Slots it into Vieira on his weak foot. On his weaker left foot. And he puts it in top bins for one. Oh, Rabbit. Rabbit is uh, excelling in this cam spot. He is absolutely excelling. He's going to have a pop from deep. Oh, Jamie with the save, or maybe Jame, I don't really know. We're going to lay this off. I'm going to wait for Vieira to make the run, if he ever does make the run. I was going to wait for him to make the run and then, and then pass it back into him, but uh, for some reason, he decided he didn't want to run with it. Machuidi, Vieira, Vieira, Ravit, Ravit, dirty, lovely goal. Absolutely fantastic goal, and 2-1 after 48 minutes becomes 5-1. After 55 minutes, we've absolutely put this guy to the sword in the last five minutes. Ravit, putting him at Cam was the best decision because he has controlled the game since he's been there. And we go 5-1 up with, uh, that's now 90,000 coins in the bag. Oh, no. Not like this, EA. Oh, I've given him. I've gifted him a goal there, guys. That puts us back down to 70,000 coins with 15 minutes to go. Ah, oh, silly defending, man. Silly defending. It's just not where I aimed the ball at all. I was looking top bins there, ref. Come on now. This game is uh, this game is trying to screw me here. Aguero against Sol Campbell is going to hit me on the inside. Obviously, everyone always does. Oh, and he scored again. And it just it's not a, the biggest problem because we're still going to make 50,000 coins. But it could have been so much more. It could have been so very much more. And that, guys, is full-time. I genuinely thought at 5-1 he was going to rage quit because it was just done and dusted. But he stuck through. He got a couple goals back, which ultimately cost me. Um, due to the way the scoring system works, I would have made 50,000 coins from that game. So not a bad way to improve the squad. But if I want to be able to add a legend in, I'm definitely going to need a huge second game. Let us get into game number two. Okay, guys, our opponent for the second game has, of course, got 100 chem, 3-4-1-2, full Brazilian silver team. Few, uh, few recognisable players there. The Chelsea uh, left mid, uh, Dos Santos, the Arsenal player playing out at Bolton, who used to have five-star skill moves, uh, among a few others in there. But um, I'm hoping we can, uh, we can go on and, and put a whole bunch of goals past our opponent here. 50,000 coins from game number one. I definitely want to improve that and try and get ourselves a legend for game number, or sorry, sorry, for episode number four to get another legend into the team. We're going to have a lot of work on to be able to do that. Ball's, uh, ball's coming in here straight away. Patrick Vieira, Captain Vieira. Oh, he's done it after just two minutes. Patrick Vieira, a well-worked goal through the midfield. And Patrick Vieira is there from the top of the box to put it in the back of the net. And that's 30,000 coins in the bag. That puts us up to 80k. Look at that. He evades the tackle and just lashes that one home. What a goal from what a guy. And we go 1-0 to the good almost instantly. And we pick this ball. This could be a whitewash. This could be one of those games. I, I can feel it. I can feel it. Here goes the captain again. He's around the challenge. Oh, no. Marlon. Oh, Rivet is through. Oh, he's on the ball as well. Rivet, surely. Oh, it's 2-0. I could have laid it off to Vieira. But Rivet scores 2-0. And that's 50,000 coins instantly for us here to, uh, to put into the bank. I don't want to rage quit. I, usually, I would want a rage quit for the 100k. But uh, in this instance, I reckon we could put 8 or 10 goals past this guy. And get an absolute wealth of coins to go into the next game with. Ribéry, lovely interception. He's got Marlon on the ball. What's he looking for? He's, he's got some skills as this guy. You know, he might be able to score a goal. I don't want him to score, obviously. Here he goes with his chance. He's tried skills in the box. He could have got a penalty off of it. But we've got a counter-attack. And Vieira's around the first, first defender. He's got Ribéry out on the left. 
He's going to use Ribéry out on the left. Are we going to go back in for Vieira? There it is. It's Patrick Vieira. It's 3-0. And it's another 30,000 coins in the bag, guys. And after just 11 minutes, we find ourselves three goals to the good with two goals from the captain. And who knows what kind of scoreline this could be. I just hope this guy doesn't rage quit and that we can actually put ourselves well on the board with a whole bunch of coins. Ah, oh, the wrong pass as well. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Patrick on a hat trick. Oh, Rabbit. Rabbit. Oh, he's got it in. I thought he was going to just back heal it, man. Just back heal it. It's 4 0, 37 minutes in. That's uh, 100,000 coins now from this game so far. Rabbit. Oh, he went the long way around doing it, but he got there in the end. And 4 0 is the current scoreline after we nearly. Nearly conceded a goal, but Jens Lehmann came up huge in the bins and uh, stops it from going in. And uh, this, this guy's tricky, man. He's tricky on the ball. I'll give him that. That's a great ball. Yeah, he's read it in. Doesn't matter. We got Vieira. Patrick Vieira. Hattrick Vieira. Should I say? That's 5 0. That's 130,000 coins in the bag, and we are getting a legend. We are hopefully a good legend. A rage quit here would be great. 130,000 coins, 5 0. He's gone. He's gone. 230,000 coins from this game, 50,000 coins from the other game. That's 280,000 coins. I don't know what kind of legend that's going to allow us to get, but it's going to be a legend somehow. 280,000 coins. Let's get into the choices. Okay, guys, so the two choices you're going to have for the next episode of Fatal are going to be either Lundberg and Inform Florenzi at right back or Lalas and third Inform Kozawa at left back. I'm probably going to switch back to the 4-3-2-1 uh, for the next game. So it'll be uh, Vieira, Stryker, Ribery, and then either um, the, the current right forward I have or Lundberg. Or we can have Lalas and really complete that legend defence and inform Kozawa at left back, which uh, will be pretty good. And if we do go with Florenzi at right back, when Vieira drops into that slot in midfield, Florenzi will then have two legends next to him. So he'll get the full chemistry anyway. So you guys decide what you want to see. Link to the straw poll is in the description below. Thank you for watching. Drop a thumbs up and I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.